Greetings, oh great viewer of mine. My name is Gruon Star. Welcome to my channel where I make videos about whatever I want. This is my series where I review specific Just Dance maps. If you don't know what a map is, it's what we call the songs that you play slash select from the menu in Just Dance. The song we're covering today is Automate Ton Tomato Version. Before we begin the review, we should start with some background information. Automaton is the second song by J. Miroquai, hopefully I didn't butcher that name, in the series. Automaton also has one word censored in the game. This alternate version has three gold moves, has a difficulty rating of medium, an effort rating of moderate, and it was first playable in Just Dance 2018. It also has one possible coach, but that's pretty obvious. Now that the background information is out of the way, let's begin with the song itself. The song itself, in my opinion, is really good. I really do like the song, and it has a lot of very, very new sounds. There's, there really isn't m many ways to describe it. It's the type of song that I put on when I want to feel, if that makes any sense. You can really tell that Jay Meroquai, hopefully I didn't butcher that name, I'm so sorry if I did, really put a lot of effort into this song. I especially liked near the end where there were a bunch of really metallic sounds and it was so good. Too bad I can't show you the example of what I'm talking about because YouTube is terrible. Anyway, I should make it clear that I am no Anthony Fantano. I obviously can't go into very much detail and honestly my song preferences are, were, well, some people might call them absolutely terrible. So take my reviews with a grain of salt. But I really like the song. I'd give it an 8 out of 10. Moving on to the choreography, which I am much better at, although I'm still no professional, is that it's actually really hard to not be in a good mood whenever you're playing this song. It takes all of the anger, all the bad vibes that you may be carrying, and it just takes it away, which is mostly why I'm reviewing this alternate version first instead of the original version, which we would call original map, by the way. I also like that they didn't edit the song specifically for this alternate version, so you still hear all the metallic sounds and all the references to being a robot, despite that you're watching a tomato dance to this song. This choreography and this map in general really just represents everything that is great about Just Dance. Just relax, unwind, and enjoy dancing as a tomato if you want to. What other game can you say lets you play as a tomato? That brings me to the characters, as in the one character that you play as, which is the tomato. The tomato itself looks really, really funny to me. The dancer is a tomato with sunglasses, yellow dots around the frame, a black goatee, and two gloves. The left one is white, a golden bracelet, and the right one is light blue, which is the one that you're supposed to follow with your right hand. Under that, he has a green shirt with green pants. He also wears white sneakers. I gotta say, I gotta give the character design here a 10 out of 10, what can I say? Onto the gold moves, where there are three of them. In the first one, you stand straight with your arms held at right angles, almost in front of your face. <laughs> that one's really fun, and he does it about a few times. In the second one, you lean to the left with your right arm pointed in front of you and slowly bring it back to an arm upward arc. That one is also really fun. In the third gold move, you point forward with your right arm and kick your left leg. That one is the most fun. And I gotta say, the overall gold moves have been really good. I'm gonna have to give these ones like an, a solid eight or a soft nine. I also forgot to mention it earlier, but the choreography gets an eight out of 10 also. It's not the most unique, but it is really, really fun. Now let's discuss the background that they decided to use. It's pretty simple, all things considered. It's really just a fridge with some moving food items, which can eventually turn into a wild space area, which I think is really nice, but I'm gonna have to dock some points for the lack of creativity with this one, which earns this background a six out of 10. Overall, Automaton Tomato Version by J. Meroquai gets a solid 8 out of 10. Thank you for getting to the end of my video. If you liked the video, let YouTube know by hitting the like button. And if you want to see more, then please subscribe and hit the bell. If you want to see me live and definitely a little crazier, then please check out my Twitch streams at twitch.tv slash or with the link in the description. Until next time, adios.